In this video, I want to introduce uh, the concept of log, uh, which uh, is very useful when you learn uh, higher mathematics because uh, the log is applied in many areas. Okay, so uh, let me give you a background of log now, uh, say 10 or 15 years ago, uh, or even say 20 years ago, when people didn't have calculators, they used log to multiply or divide or huge multiplication used to be done by using the log table. But now as you have calculators, there's no need to learn that, but log has got a wide application. So we need to learn what is log. So log is basically a different way of expressing an exponent form. So what, what does that mean? So let me talk about some exponents. So as we, are, as we have a decimal system, which is based on 10, uh, let us first understand what is a decimal number system. Okay, now, <clears throat> it's suppose you have a whole number, say, 245. Now, this as can be written as a decimal form. So, this two is in the hundreds place, this is in the tens place, and this is in the ones place. So, this, this is 200, which is two times 100. So, I'm going to write this in a tens form. So this is two times, this two is nothing but two times 10 squared. Four is 40, that is four times 10 to the power one. And phi is nothing but phi times 10 to the power zero. Okay, so let me show this on a calculator just for fun. So this is two times 10 squared plus four times 10 to the power one plus five times 10 to the power zero. Okay, so let me move the calculator. So this, if you press equal, this is 245. So this is in the, uh, in the expanded form. Okay, now suppose you may wonder what happens if it is a 24.56. So this is in the tens place, this is in the ones place, this is in the one tens place, and this is 100. So this can be written as two times 10 to the power one, because in the tens place, plus four times 10 to the power zero. So this is four, this is 20. Point, point phi can be written as plus phi, times 10 to the power negative 1. I'll show this on a calculator. Plus, this is 0 0.06, which is 6 times 10 to the power negative 2. So this is 600. So let me show this on a calculator. So, oops. So let me move this. Okay. So yeah, so this is, uh, so this is 2, times 10 to the power 1. Just to show you this is a decimal system or expanded form of writing in tens. Plus 4 times 10 to the power 0. Plus 5 times 10 to the power negative 1. Plus 6 times 10 raised to minus 2. Uh, I've done something wrong. Uh, so 2 times 10 to the power 1, yeah, plus 4 times, oh, this is, I made mistakes, sorry, let me do it again. So 2 times 10 raised to 1, plus 4 times 10 raised to zero, okay, plus five times 10 to the power negative one, plus six times 10 to the power negative two, equals 24.56. Okay, so this is, you may wonder what am I doing? Where am I leading this to? So this is everything in 
in tense form or so this is expanded form okay now so before introducing to log so let me write some basic facts that you should know suppose let me start with 10 to the power 0 10 to the power 0 is 1 10 or any number to the power 0 is always 1 okay I'll show this on a calculator 10 to the power 1 you should know is 10 10 squared is 10 times 10 which is 100 and you can go on so 10 to the power 3 is 1000 okay now if it is 10 to the power negative 1 this is nothing but my pen is uh, not working properly 10 to the power negative 1 is equal to 1 over 10 which is I'll show this on a calculator 0 0.1 if you struggle you can use your calculator 10 to the power negative 2 10 to the power negative 2 negative 2 is nothing but 1 over 10 squared which is nothing but 1 over 100 which is 0 0.01 and finally okay 10 to the power negative 3 is equal to same principle 10 to the power 1 over 10 to the power 3 which is 1 over 1000 which is which is 0 0.001 okay so let me show this on a calculator the late okay so 10 I can't see the zero oops I want to show that okay I think this is okay hold on so this is 10 to the power zero is one 10 to the power 1 is 10 I hope you know that so let me look at negative powers okay so let me do 10 squared 10 to the power 2 is 100 and so on but 10 to the power negative 1 is oh sorry 10 to the power negative 1 is 0.1 that's what we saw 10 to the power negative 2 is 0 0.01 10 to the power negative 3 is 0 0.001 that's or uh, if you don't understand this 0 0.001 is uh, this is in the scientific form this is 0 0.001 okay so having said that now what is log so let me define log. Log is nothing but a different way of writing an exponent form. So let me define. So this is the definition of log. Okay. So log is nothing but writing exponent in a different way. If this is the definition, if b, this is b for b's to any power, say x will give you a number say it's y so this is called the exponent form this double implies so this is the notation of double implies that means you can go from year to year or from year to year so this is called exponent form now this can be written as a log form like this this is same as log of log of y base b is equal to x now this may sound very funny this is interesting now this is how I remember the base for both the form. This, this is how you read log base b of y is equal to x. Or read when you want to convert from this form to this form, b to the power x is equal to y. Okay. Now what does this mean? Okay. This means, so let me let us apply this. This implies 10. Let us only talk about 10. We can talk about other logs. So 10 to the power, say 2, is 100. 10 to the power 2 is 100. We know that. So the same thing if you want to write in the log form, it's written like this, log 100, or sorry, base 10 of 100 is equal to 2. 
is equal to 2. This and this are the same. So this is how we read. This is how you can uh, uh, answer. Log 100 base 10 is equal to 2 means 10 to the power 2 is equal to 100. That's what it means. Suppose 10 to the power, say, 4 or 10 to the power 3, just we just saw is 1000 which implies this is the exponent form if you want to write this in the log form so log base 10 always start with the base 10 this is this is the power this is the base and this is the answer so log base 10 of 1000 1000 is called the argument so i'll not go into that log base 10 of 1000 is equal to 3 i'll show this on a calculator okay so let me take one more 10 to the power minus 2, 10 to the power minus 2, we saw on a calculator, 10 to the power minus 2 is 1 over 100, which is 0 0.01, 0 0.01, which implies log base 10 of 0 0.01 0 0.01 0 0.01 0 0.01 is equal to negative 2 okay so yeah now on a calculator so this is your calculator uh, on a calculator one so let me delete this this is the log key now we don't write base the calculator doesn't have the base you can you see on the top you have got 10 to the power x so base when you write log it is understood the base is 10 so if you press log 100 it will give me 2 what does this mean this means the base is 10 10 squared is 100 if you press log 1000 log 1000 would give me 3 how do I know? Because 10 to the power 3 is 1000. If you press log of 0 0.01, that will give you negative 2 because 10 to the power negative 2 is 0 0.01. Now, if suppose you want to answer, suppose log, suppose log base 10 of 15 is equal to so i don't know i can't do it so i'll use a calculator so we'll go backwards from year to year if this is a log form log base 10 of 15 is equal to so let me use a calculator log that is same as type in log 15 log 15 is 1.17 this okay so i'm not writing 1.176 so this is one point one seven six dot 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 okay so this means if you want to write this as an exponent form this implies 10 to the power this whole number 1.17 this is this should be very clear 10 to the power 1.176 dot 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 is should be 15. So let us check that on the calculator. So I can do it like this. This is an answer. So I can go 10 to the power. So let me type in the whole thing. <clears throat> 1.1760912592 equal is 15. Or I could have also gone like this. Uh, log of 15 is so let me cancel log of 15 is one point this means 10 to the power this number so you can go also like this shift answer sorry let's do it again log of 15 is so i can go to check my answer or to express this in log form 10 raised to this is raised to shift answer is equal to 15. okay so this and this are, so let me take one more example, say 10, uh, say log of, let me take one more example, log of, say 20, 
to the base 10 is should be one point something i think so so log 15 is one point uh oh sorry log of 20 sorry i was wondering what's happening log of 20 is 1.3010 so so let me write that 1.3010 1.3010 it goes on so this if you want to write as an exponent form this means 10 to the power 1.30 3010 should give you 20 okay so let's check that so you go 10 raised to answer shift answer is equal to 20. I'm going to discuss about the log rules in the next week.